give us a SID rep. Right. Evacuation of the surrounding area commences at 0245. Emergency kite alert. Emergency kite alert. Epicenter located in Saga Kha. Citizens in the surrounding area were asked to evacuate. Isn't the defense force here yet? Then we gotta use the bathroom, Bobby! Please remain calm! All personnel will be arrived soon! There will be enough room for everyone! Thank you for your cooperation! You've got JSDF support. Yes, ma'am. They're setting up an artillery command post at the Leon Mall parking lot now. Deploying the FL. Observation post constructed. What's our status on the evac? What do we know about this home, Jim? It burrowed underground and began growing shortly after emerging near Kanawa Fault. Surfacing now because it's beginning its reproduction phase. The Honju's reemergence was accompanied by the appearance of large numbers of Yoju. No kidding. How many of these bastards are there? Well, hey, at least the neutralization area is fairly close. In order to minimize collateral damage, we need to be careful about where we neutralize the Honju. Our best option is the middle of Sector Bravo. That's where I'll be taking the shot on the Honju. The sniper nest will be here in Sector Echo. We'll have a clear line of sight along National Route 16. We'll log this mission as the Sagamihara neutralization operation. Move out, and best of luck. Lit. Let's do it, Captain. So, how you guys feel? Everyone ready to go hunt some kaiju? First mission. You're Kaiju number eight. I still can't believe it. Don't you dare disappoint me out there. Kafka Himino. This nigga already fought like three Kaisers already. <laughs> Old man. The intro live, by the way. The intro is heat. Captain Ashido is currently eight minutes from her vantage point. 
It's time, sir. You ready? Yeah. This is my chance to prove I can actually do the job. You keep improving at this rate, you're getting tossed. You got three months to shape up. My one chance. Tension. Panic. It's a whole summer. I don't think I've ever felt this kind of pressure before. And yet, for some reason, I am absolutely pumped right now. Of course you are. You're finally doing the job you've always wanted. Okay, sir. Liddy. It's time for our first day on the job. Let's crush it. <laughs> right. Sector Echo. Yoju sighted in your vicinity. That's us. Let's move, Kikoru. And who exactly told you you could order me around? Don't die, Chikawa. Same to you, sir. <laughs> All right. Here goes. Time to rock my first mission. Charge! <laughs> what the fuck is he doing, bro? She got a crush on this old ass nigga now. I did. But still, I have to keep getting stronger. So Kafka will never have to transform. Yeah, get off this nigga dick. Like 
heard it. Yeah. I heard we got lucky with this year's crop, but I wasn't ready. I missed six confirmed kills now. So what have you been doing over there, Haruichi? Oh, me? I was putting in most of the work on four of those six. Oh, you knew that. A rough and ready military type. And a clean-cut prodigy. Oh, Mama's eating good this year! You were just luck like that? Vice Captain Hoshina mentioned before that there were some real standouts in the group. But it goes beyond that. These guys' average combat power is a step above your usual batch. They're all pushing themselves constantly to keep up with the top guns. Eight kills! Like hell, that was mine! Status update. Observation teams confirm Sector Juliet is clear. All Yoju neutralized. Just getting started and the kill reports are pouring in. Man, these guys are awesome. Ikaruga platoon will Why aren't you helping? Ichikawa and Yaru too. Mm. This sucks. Everyone's going as hard as they can and I'm just dead weight. There's gotta be some way I can help, right? Wait. Nigga, shoot your gun. Listen up! We don't have any info on these things' weak points yet. Hang back and play it safe till we hear something from the front line! Super important information. Thank you, nigga. What the fuck? I'm sure you picked up some of that from your old job, but clearly your study sessions paid off. Damn fine work. I'm really helping the defense force. I'm moving out. I can neutralize any corpses in my area. Anything I can do to contribute to the mission, no matter how small. One step closer to meet his side. The heck? Looks like they're getting started. Honju has reached the designated combat initiation point. JSDF ground and air forces, please withdraw. All defense force platoons, focus fire on the Honju's leg. Sustain fire and keep it pinned down as long as possible. Oh, damn. Target acquired. Coriolis and gravity compensation complete. No additional targets in the AO. First round loaded. Ready to fire. Roger. All conditions met. You are clear to commence fire. We'll both join and see who could be a cooler defense force officer. Well, Kafka. Take a look. This is where I'm at. Yeah, talk that shit. Unleashed combat power, 96%. Kafka, you better be watching. Fire! Damn! That's that. crazy. That was the woman you're looking to stand beside. Second round, ready to fire. Okay, oh, shoot that platoon. <laughs> <to fire. laughs> 
What? How do vital signs have disappeared? Yo, that's crazy. It's Loaded, ready to fire. Uh, and what? Cleared to fire. Hongju has taken critical damage. It stopped moving. Captain, there's something else. That's crazy. Fourth round, ready to fire. Bro, this bitch is. Captain, the Hongju's vitals are gone, and it's not even tweaking. the order. Bro, this bitch is crazy. She really is on a whole different level. So, you ready to give it up yet? If you want to stand by her side, you got to be able to match that level of strength. Should I take that to mean you're capable of putting up that kind of power yourself, Vice Captain? <laughs> Not a chance. Not a chance! When it comes to guns, my combat power is nothing to write home about. Captain's always going to be first pick against the big guys. Now, as far as handling small to mid-sized threats... Enemy behind you, Vice Captain! I'd say I've got the edge on her. Did you see this, nigga? Are those swords? I never even saw him pull them out. That was love. I come from a line of kaiju hunters. That was love. All the way back to the Muromachi period. Swordsmanship is a family tradition. Captains and vice captains are the strongest fighters in the entire defense force. That's why they give us specialized gear to suit our individual strengths. This bitch still going? Yeah. The Hongju's down. Roger. Okay, yeah. good talk. Now for the main event. Uh, but I thought you just said she'd taken down the Hongju. I told you. Killing the Honju isn't nearly enough to take care of this threat. The real problem is the swarms of Yoju inside its body. Just as I thought. Here they come. And now, they're heading our way. Damn. Yo, that's crazy. Okay, good job, team. Clean up time. Let's make it quick. Finish them off, and we can go home to a hearty breakfast. You call this cleanup? It might as well be a whole new mission. <laughs> what? The rookies don't want to fight anymore. Someone's got to work on their stamina. <laughs> All right, you guys. There's more to this job than unleashed combat power. Let's show these newbies how it's done. <laughs> What's up, boys? Platoon leader Nakanoshima. You're welcome to kick back and let the veterans take care of the rest. You know, if you want. We're headed back out there, ma'am. All the new recruits are showing signs of fatigue. Unleashed combat power and endurance are both decreasing. Well, they did get a hell of a mission for their first time in the field. But still, if they pull through this, they'll reach a whole new level. Most Defense Force officers' combat power tops out around 20 to 30 percent. That's the plateau they stay on for the length of their careers. Only a handful of exceptional candidates will ever be able to get over that wall and reach the rank of captain. As of right now, the only one who's shown that kind of power is Kikoru Shinomiya. But I'd say there's a chance. That Reno Ichikawa could reach a similar level before long. Okay, nigga. Talk that talk. Five years in technical college, training my butt off for this every single day. So why the hell can't I keep up with this kid? Hey, Iharu, I think we've mopped up all the Yoju in this sector. Yeah, looks like it. New Yoju sighted, entering sector Foxtrot. There they are. Let's get back to the front. Right. Crew needs to 
stay clear till the fighting is over. <sighs> so they got this one too. I loaded them with reproductive organs, but they've been destroyed. How did they even know where to look? Maybe someone on the force is more knowledgeable. This is crazy. Um, this is one of my new favorite shows. Kaiju and Bread is like that. I see this now. Um, loving the vice captain, loving the fact he fight with knives, that's hard as fuck. Um, the captain though, that bitch is crazy. I love that. Love that, love that, love that, love that. Um, I see the MC is doing the usual, I'm a fight with my head type deal, Deku type of guy. Um, Kuroko, no basket. I'm rocking with it. Um, it's getting me hyped because I know his potential going to be through the roof when he like gets his strength, for real, for real. So, this is dope. This is a really dope show. I'm really fucking with it. Let me know what you guys think down in the comment section below. Until next time, peace. Just been it.